Hi Taurus, welcome to your first week of June reading. If you are new here and don't want to miss the daily tarot readings, subscribe now by clicking the red button below this video. This is a general love reading, so it may or may not resonate with all of you. At the end of this video, if you are interested, I will also record an extended reading to know more specific details on their feelings and intentions for you at this moment. Now let's start with your reading. First, let's shuffle the deck five times for you. Let's see what is the overall energy. Is the Nine of Swords. Overthinking about something that didn't go well. About uh, feeling sad and unsure about the future. On the future of that connection. Let's see the other cards for more details. First, let's see what happened in the past. Eight of Pentacles. I see you focused you or them, or both of you, were focused on work. Knight of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Or it may have been that both of you were really, seemed very interested to solve this connection, even if it took too much of a time. Now, what is affecting you in your subconscious that you may not be aware of is the Three of, is the three of Swords in the reverse. Is, sorry, it's the Four of Swords in the reverse, so you want to turn back to them. Or you can't stop thinking about them. There has been silence treatment, no communication, but you want to be back to them. This is what is uh, happening in your subconscious and you may not be aware of. How you view the situation? Four of Cups in the reverse. Maybe you think it is too late now. It is too late for a reunion or reconciliation. The time to take the chance and try again to save the connection was before, but not now. At the current situation, you have the King of Swords and the Fool card. You want to take a leap of faith, but you want to be very logical and not rush anything. So you want to put your mind before your heart into making any decisions regarding love. Now, something you want to avoid is having a conflictual relationship again. It seems like the previous connection or previous connections were full of conflicts and arguments, not finding the common language, and maybe someone played mind games as well. And your hope is not to be single anymore, but you want to be to find your perfect partner. Maybe them. I think it is mostly them because you had the Four of Swords in the reverse and the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. Let's see what is happening with this person. Six of Swords. This person is moving away. This is this person decided to leave. Let's see why the Six of Swords. Ten of Wands, it seemed too much for them to bear. That's why they decided to move away. Yes, Nine of Wands, this person is very guarded and also decided to move away. So two cards, Hangman in the reverse and the Six of Swords, have the same meaning here about moving away. Let's see what is the potential outcome. Three of Pentacles. Page of Swords and the Five of Wands in the reverse. So those two cards fell out from this other deck and it tells me that they want to talk. Now I don't see how because they are leaving, they decided to leave, but in the near future I see some kind of reunion. Two cards, Five of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles. Okay, the Empress at the bottom of the deck. So. There will be a way this person will come back 
uh, towards you. I think uh, not at this right moment, not immediately, because I see them leaving away. This person is a bit stubborn, but they will feel left out in the cold and they will try to talk to you. They will talk and the idea is to have a reconciliation. I don't see uh, them being ready to retry again for having a romantic relationship, but they just want not to miss a very good friend and they don't want to to lose a very good friendship. They, that's why they want to make the connection fair, right, and uh, maybe they will apologize as well if they did something wrong. Meanwhile, they are uh, moving away, they are looking back, watching you in social media, so they are still interested, and I see some form of reunion happening. For some of you, this person may have been in your workplace. It doesn't have to resonate with all of you, but take what resonates. Anyway, this person will communicate back. They will talk. I don't sense feelings there. Just the idea of not losing a good friendship as well. Anyway, I will continue this reading in the extended video where I want to view more about the energies of this spread. Also, how does your person feel now? Let's see about their feelings. I don't see feelings here. But let's see about what the cards uh, will tell us more. Also, how do they view you now? And what are their intentions? They are moving away, but they will talk, as we saw here. Let's see about their intentions in the extended video of this spread. So if you want to watch it, you can find it in the description box below. And see you the next reading. And bye for now.